Good morning um, viewers all over the world. My name is Dr. Vincent Mutupi. I come from Botswana, Maun to be specific. Um, I'm a regular visitor. Actually, I'm a son. Um, I'm based in Maung. have been coming to Charis from 2017. So it was just one of those um, visits that I do regularly to come and meet our father one-on-one. -on -one. Yes, um, the specific reason for coming was just uh, I was seeing stagnation on my on the ministry, plus also, like I said, just a, res a regular visit. So it was mainly to get direction and, uh, and guidance. And um, basically, Daddy confirmed uh, what I was seeing, that the ministry is stagnant. People come and go. But he says, you know what, you are closer to your breakthrough. Your impact will be felt. Continue in the ministry. Um, he, he mentioned the fact that my wife is not feeling well. But he, all this is basically also the signs that the devil does not like what I'm doing. And uh, the, si the signs that we are, we are getting, uh, the breakthrough is closer. Yes, my, my wife is not well. Um, she's not incapacitated, but she's complaining about body pains, um, specifically in the stomach. So that is, uh, that is true. But Daddy said she'll be fine, and I believe that when I get home, she will definitely be fine. Yes. Well, I want to confirm the fact that the ministry is not, is not doing well. Um, I expected growth, quite a big growth by now, but uh, the growth is there, although slow. But once the servant of God has spoken, I know that um, things will turn around. Hallelujah. Much, much encouraged. You know, when you are staying away from your spiritual leader, um, most of the time you are alone. He's a phone call away. But to come and visit him is different to when you are talking to him either on the phone or via WhatsApp. It's uplifting. Um, you feel empowered once you have spoken to him. So, yeah, no, I feel it's a... It's, um, it's now now or never. You really have to push on once you've been prayed for, you feel empowered. I want to encourage particularly the pastors, those who are called, those who are running ministries, those who are starting. It's not an easy journey. You are fighting a spiritual battle. You are fighting a spiritual war. The, the idea is once um, you have started, you have started. You can't give up. Just continue getting um, encouragement. Um, prayers from the anointed servant of God and you'll make it.